Hey YouTube, what's up guys? Anyway, um, we are at the day of the iPad 3 announcement. If you're a true Apple fan, you're probably watching this video, and if you're a hater, you're probably watching this video to write, Android's better, but not really. Anyway, um, I thought I'd post my last minute predictions on what I thought would be in the iPad 3. There's too much glare on these. Um, anyway, the last minute for the iPad 3. Here's what I think. Definitely, number one, Rena Display. Number two, definitely Siri. Three, better camera. Definitely thicker. There's going to be a home button, despite the speculation that there'd be no home button. And I think a faster processor. And I think there's not going to be major changes. I do not think 4G LTE at this point. I think even though, despite Verizon saying that we said no devices that aren't 4G devices, despite Verizon saying that, I think still into the iPad and Apple can get away with just a 3G iPad. Now it's possible that there'd be 4G LTE, but I think it's unlikely. I think we're going to see iPhone, the iPhone, the next iPhone with 4G before we see an iPad with 4G. Um, the only reason that the iPad 3 is supposedly going to be thicker is to power that, thicker, that better display with a battery, and I think that makes a lot more sense. Well, anyway guys, those are the few things. So, Siri, Retina display, uh, iOS 5.1 which will be something, who knows, whatever the hell, we can delete stuff out of a uh, photo stream finally, one at a time. <laughs> um, yeah, so Siri, we're going to display iOS 5.1, they're going to talk about Mountain Lion, Apple TV 3, and um, I think that's about it. I don't think it's going to be super awesome. I think there's going to be another camera, and I think the whole point is I'm going to have my iPad 2, and that's not going to be any bait. It's going to be able to do everything I could do just better, but not so much that mine feels left out. That's my thoughts. Um, I don't think it's going to be that huge of an announcement. I think we've over-exaggerated with LTE, and I think that people think that there's going to be you know crazy stuff that... that concept video of the um, displays merging with the two displays connecting to each other which pretty pretty freaking cool with the edge to edge with the magnets that made awesomeness and I would totally buy two of those if they existed but they don't um, and they never well I shouldn't say they never will but I don't think it'll be anytime soon and I really don't see the um, the real necessary need to connect two iPads to each other so that you could have an extended display on an iPad. Anyway, that's what I was thinking. I hope you guys um, watch the event. I'm going to watch the Twit coverage and I'm probably going to um, scan t or um, skim through today's iPhone.com and um, I will probably have a vlog to talk about what I think of the announcement. I'm still thinking only Retina Display, Siri, and a better camera and a faster processor. but whatever is in it it will work because it always just works according to Steve Jeffs but he's dead so I don't know if that'll work anyway no guys it'll work it'll be fine and I can't wait I'm extremely excited I'm probably gonna get an Apple TV 3 because I can't live without my Apple TV 2 and I'd really like some 1080p and I'd also like an Apple TV in the living room anyway guys I am rambling on I will see you guys in a vlog probably about this if I don't make a vlog too bad you'll live without it okay bye